Welcome back to another Proto Tech Tip. I'm Brian and today I'm going to go over the aspects of the CNC machining process that will impact your costs. In addition to custom manufacturing sheet metal, Protocase also makes CNC machine enclosures and parts in as fast as two to three days with no minimum order. We can manufacture your design quickly, but when it comes to CNC machining, planning is critical. CNC machining designs and projects can sometimes get unnecessarily complex. Some designs do require precise detail that cannot be simplified. But you do have options if you have the flexibility to change aspects of your design and are keen to reduce costs. So, let's talk about a few ways to reduce machining costs to your overall design. First off, your material choice. When it comes to CNC machining, the harder the material, the more difficult it is to machine. This is because we have to use processes and cutting parameters that take more time. We recommend using 6061 aluminum for CNC jobs as it provides a balance of toughness, strength, corrosion resistance, and most importantly, excellent manufacturability. Secondly, the more you simplify your design, the more you can reduce the costs of your project. Highly detailed parts may require multiple setups, leading to a higher cost. Some complex projects that have machining on multiple faces can be less expensive with proper modifications. For example, if you have a part with holes or slots on all faces, consider moving those details to the same face if possible. This will cut down on setup costs and save you some money. Next up, try to minimize the bulk removal of material. Most parts are made from stock, which starts as a rectangular or cylindrical shape. The amount of stock removed has a direct effect on the price of your design. Try to imagine the smallest box that would fit around your finished part. The volume inside the box, which does not contain your part, represents the material that will need to be removed to manufacture your part. The more empty space you have, the more material will need to be removed. The more material removed, the higher the cost, so modifying your design for less empty space will reduce that cost. We also recommend keeping tolerances as large as your design will allow to increase manufacturability and therefore lower cost. If a tight tolerance is required, we can accommodate, but it's best to keep that tolerance above at least plus or minus five thou to minimize costs. Another thing to consider is your corner radius. By using the largest radii possible for your design, you will both increase surface finish quality and reduce machining costs. The inside corner radius of your part should always be as large as the function of your part allows. But if you need a smaller inside corner radius, then the minimum of that radius will be decided by the depth of that corner. You can find more information about this in the How to Cut Costs for CNC Machining blog, which we've linked below. Lastly, if your project is price sensitive, you can always use an off-the-shelf enclosure. We can special order off-the-shelf die-cast enclosures and customize them for you. A pre-made die-cast enclosure can be significantly less expensive because no material is wasted in manufacturing the cast OTS enclosure, whereas the custom machine enclosure is made from a solid block of material. When you use an OTS enclosure, we can cut holes as per your design. This will save you time and money. This concludes today's Proto Tech Tip. To sum it up, when designing your CNC machine part or enclosure, take into consideration the level of complexity that is required for manufacturing your part and how you can simplify the design. Remember, the higher the manufacturability, the lower the cost. You can learn more about Protocase's two to three day, no minimum order CNC machining by visiting our website. And if you have any feedback or questions, leave a comment below or email us at info at protocase.com. Thank you for watching and see you next week.